Number seven, nine, Lima, understand you want, to IFR, you want to cancel your IFR clearance? Yeah, we'll cancel the IFR, or I'll we'll, we'll continue the flight VFR. Number 187, nine, Lima, IFR, cancel your receiver, air service, terminus, clock, maintain VFR, free change for... Squad maintain VFR, frequency change approved. You have a good day. Thank you for your help. 187 Mooney, you can turn your base runway 28 right to skinny runway clear to land at or beyond the green dot. Orange shirts for further instructions. Well, All right, we're descending. We just canceled our RFR. Like when center phone arrival is clearance, and we're going to descend time. to 1700. Wind 2908. Gust one. And we'll turn our lights on. Clear. Temperature tree one, dew point one six, altimeter tree zero. And you'll keep an eye outside, okay? Okay. The airport from Lake Parker, which is seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Winter Airport. Monitor Lake Parker approach on frequency one two four point five. Remain well clear of the class Delta airspace en route to Lake Parker. All aircraft approach Lake Parker from the east of the North Shore Power Plant with the white strobe, the GPS coordinate V Parker. As you approach the stacks, look for other aircraft in the vicinity to follow. Do not fly side by side. When you are over the stacks, you should be on a heading of 270. Turn your landing lights on. Lower your landing gear and squawk standby. Maintain 100 knots at 1,200 feet. If unable, maintain 150 knots at 1,700 feet. Depart the power plant on a westbound heading until reaching the Interstate Highway I-4. Turn southwestbound and follow the Interstate Highway I-4 for approximately three miles. Look for the golf course on your left, and you'll be 3.5 miles north of the Lakeland Airport. Immediately after passing the golf course, turn left and fly southbound direct to the control tower of the Lakeland Airport. Keep the ball-shaped white water tower to your right and the wind cap all the way down to the epic left. Monitor Lakeland Tower on frequency Altitude. 135.225. Follow all instructions from air traffic controllers and enter a closed right downwind for runway 28 right. Use caution, do not encroach on the parallel final to landing traffic. Runway 28 right is 75 feet wide and has a three thousand five hundred foot Lake Parker, which is located in the Lake Parker. Take your approach to the drone. Land on the green line. Get in line, tail on a westerly heading. Pass in between the smokestack and the power plant westbound. Our landing lights are on, and uh, we'll be getting our gear down very soon. So you keep your eyes out yep. for traffic. And you listen. Ahead. And that's class Delta is telling us. Uh -huh. And we're going to be really... All aircraft inbound to Lakeland, proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Airport, then proceed to a point three miles east of the North Shore Power Plant. Nose to tail on a westerly heading, pass in between the smokestack and the power plant westbound. All the lights are on. Take your approach All aircraft to inbound Lakeland, Lake proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Airport, then proceed to a point three miles east of the North Shore Power Plant. Get in line, nose to tail, on a westerly heading. There's an airplane right there. And a smokestack, 1,200 feet and 100 knots. And it's going this way. 1,700 okay. feet and 150 knots. Proceed westbound. Remain single file. Fly westbound to join I-4. Rolling over the west shore there, Rocky Wings. Oh, I see. There, good rock. Continue westbound, join I-4. Follow off four southwestbound, turn left immediately after passing the golf course, keep the golf course on your left, water towers on your right, fly directly towards that blue roof terminal building. You got the airplane? Close in, Go. right downwind, along the frontage road for runway 28 right. That's the skinny runway, the runway with the dots on it. Once you are southbound off I-4, monitor the tower on 135.225, and welcome to Sun of Fun. All aircraft inbound to Lakeland, proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Airport, then proceed to a point three miles east of the North Shore Power Plant. Pass between the power plant and the smokestack westbound over the shore, nose to tail. So right now, we're six nautical miles from that lago, which is uh, just a little bit southeast of Lake Myrtle. All uh right. -huh. And we're going to be coming from the east to Lake Parker. And we, our speeds are good, 1,700. Everything looks great. We have all our lights, you know. All aircraft inbound to Lake Parker, proceed good. to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles Everything is Lake perfect. Airport. Proceed to a point three miles east of the North Shore Power Plant. Get in line, nose to tail westbound path between the smokestack and the power plant. 1,200 feet and 100 knots. If unable, maintain 1,700 feet and 150 knots. So what are the big arrows again? What's that? What are the big arrows? Those are uh, obstacles, Lake, which is Parker, antennas which is or big buildings. 
then proceed and if they're blue, there's no factor. Plant. If they're yellow, you're going to be careful. Westbound, pass between if they're the red, and the smoke you're dead. Westbound, 12 huh. feet, 100 knots. If unable, maintain 1,700 feet. Got to stay away. And 150 knots. Proceed westbound across over the power plant. Remain single file. After crossing, fly westbound to join I-4 southwestbound. Getting serious, Danny. Getting really serious. I'm excited. Let's see it. Lakeland, here we come. All right, now we're going to put... All aircraft inbound to Lakeland, proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Airport, then proceed to a point three miles east of the North Shore Power Plant. Get in line, nose to tail on a westerly heading, pass in between the power plant... Now we have to go over feet, Lake Myrtle, which I'm pretty sure that's this right here. Uh, did you just slow down? Yeah, I put my gear down. Okay. Got a little scared. Yeah. So we have a plane up there, and that's Lake Myrtle. All uh, right. And that's Lake Parker. All aircraft inbound to Lakeland, proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Airport, then proceed to a point three miles east of the North Shore Power Plant. Get in line, nose to tail. Yellow. That's just yellow. Path. It's in high at 600. Stack, 1, feet, Look for traffic. Miles. That's the main, feet, main, main thing I need you to do. Yep. This all plane passes way to the right. Okay. Thank you. Oh, down. To Lakeland, proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Airport, then proceed to a point three miles east of the North Shore Power Plant. Get in line, nose to tail on a westerly heading, 1,200 feet, 100 knots. If unable, maintain 1,700 feet, 150 knots. Okay. Pass in between the power Thank plant you. and bulk stack westbound. Proceed westbound. Join I-4, I-4 southwestbound. After you join I-4, landing lights on, gear down, and then turn left immediately after passing the golf course. Keep the golf course on your left, water tower on your right. You're going to fly directly towards the Blue Roof Terminal Building. Turn a close end right downwind along the front of the road. Runway 28 right, skinny runway. After you pass south of I-4, monitor tower 135.225, 135.225. So we're just a little bit uh, west of, stay there, bird. Yeah, that was, that was kind of scary. That's scary. Birds are scary. There's a lot. Another bird. Yeah, and we're staying at this altitude. Aircraft inbound to Lakeland, proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles. And we're Lake Parker, Parker right, right now. This is uh, Lake plant. Parker right here. Pass in between the power plant and smoke stacks westbound. Nose to tail, 1,200 feet, 100 knots. If unable, maintain 1,700 feet, 150 knots. Proceed westbound across over the power plant. Our main single file. Fly westbound to join I-4. So that's I-4. Okay. And we're gonna keep going. All aircraft inbound to Lakeland, proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Airport, then proceed to a point three miles east of the North for Shore power plant. Get in line, nose to tail in the westerly heading, 1,200 feet and 100 knots, if unable to maintain 1,700 feet and 150 knots. Twin over the smoke stack there, Rocky Wing. Hey, good rock. Continue Thank you. westbound now to join I-4, and then I-4 southwestbound. Turn left immediately after passing the golf sick. course. Keep the golf course on your left, water tower on your right. Don't forget to turn your landing light on, put your gear down. And then you're going to fly directly towards the Blue Roof Terminal building. Plan on a close end right down when along the frontage road for runway 28 right. That's the skinny runway, the one with the dots on it, runway 28 right. And once you are south of I-4, monitor tower on 135.225. 135.225. If you're south of I-4, you should be on the tower on 135.225. Welcome to Santa Claus. Thank you. And like Parker, that uh, Zenith Sierra Zulu is uh, approximately three miles uh, northwest now. So Smoke stack. All right, sounds good. Keep it coming. Uh, you're still direct V Parker, right? Affirmative. Excellent. Yep, we'll pick you out here soon. Thanks. All aircraft inbound to Lakeland, proceed to Lake Parker, which is located seven miles northeast of the Lakeland Airport, and proceed to a point three miles east of the North Shore Power Plant. Get in line, nose to tail, on a westerly heading, pass in between the power plant and the smoke stack westbound. 1,200 feet and 100 knots, if unable, maintain 1,700 feet and 150 knots. After you cross the shoreline, you'll be westbound to join I-4 southwestbound. Off I-4, turn left immediately after passing the golf course. Keep the golf course on your left, water tower on your right. Fly directly towards the Blue Roof Terminal building. Plan on a close in right downwind along the frontage road for runway 28 right. That's the skinny runway. Then we'll be going the runway with the south. Is that the water tower? Yep. Uh, checklist. Yes, I want you to take a look uh, just to the power plant. There's a Cessna out there westbound. Let me know if you see him. We're going to disconnect the autopilot. Okay. 
I don't have the Cessna yet. I have to uh, we'll slow yeah, down. Him. He's uh, headed westerly, correct? Just coming up on the uh, lake. And yeah, when we get... Go ahead and rock your wings for us. Make sure we got you. Hey, there you go. Good rock. Good rock. Yep, go ahead now. That you is got correct. That's in sight. Plan on good. falling in right behind him and then, uh, and that's, and then make that's your westbound. That's the right there. there. Okay, we'll follow that Cessna. Thank you, sir. Cessna over the North Shore. Rock your wings. Hey, good rock. Nice work. Okay, now you're westbound until I-4 join I-4 southwestbound. For both you and What's the Zenith, you're going to go southwest. Zenith, I appreciate your patience. You can go west at the end, cross the big runway, and then follow the flagman on the other side. Thank you. And on I-4, turn left immediately after passing the golf course. Keep Wind to north. Turn to the south, please. ...towards the Blue Roof Terminal building, and then you're going to plan on a close-in downwind along the front of... 1,000. And we're going to stay right here. All right. We're going to loop around again. And land. Pay attention to uh, the traffic. Yep. Lakeland Tower, do you want us to uh, continue left down, uh, right downwind? Twin, you can start your downwind turn to the left. Left turn for the right downwind, 28 right, the skinny runway. Tell me where you're from. Coming from Delray Beach, Antiquers. Oh, very good. Well, welcome to Lakeland. Thank you. So we got landing gear down, fuel mixture, everything is good. That's good. Okay, Delray Beach, you can start that right turn to the orange dot. You're cleared to land after the green dot. Go ahead and give me that right turn for the base leg now. It's going to be one continuous turn directly to the orange dot. Wow, that's tight. That's sweet. Everybody that's coming off of Lake Parker along I-4, when you see the golf course, you'll make a left. Keep the cake tower off of your left. The golf ball white water tower off your right. You can head directly to the Blue Roof Terminal building. And set up for a nice tight right downwind for 2-8 right, the skinny runway. Plan on a very short approach for the orange dot to land after the green dot. And once you're on the ground, you'll high-speed taxi all the way to the end. 500. That is 400. So we have to land on the orange dot. Okay. Red, blue, green. Oh, I see it. You see it? Yep. All right, good. 200. That's the orange dot right there. Yep. 100. Nice job. Thank you. Nice job, Delray. You're going to roll all the way to the end. High speed taxi. It'll be a left turn. You'll cross the big runway and then follow the flagman on the other side. Welcome to Lakeland. Thank you. Nice. We're going to put both here just in case. Welcome to Delray. To Delray. <laughs> Welcome to Lakeland, guys. Fun and fun, here we come. A little, uh, little after the orange dot. And we're gonna continue our taxi. I thought it was a master landing. Thank there you, thank you so much. Oh, that was Bob and Pam. Just a mile north, start your downwind turn, please. Justin Zenith, and I'm glad that he's right. Thanks for coming in. It's not going to be long before I give you a base leg. Thank you, sir. That helicopter. Zenith, give me that base leg now. I want you to angle directly at the orange dot. You're going to set it down after the green. Will this? Follow this guy? Follow this guy. That's cool. Uh, Zenith, uh, you should doing? be lined up for like two eight right, the skinny runway. The so Zenith go around. Zenith go around. Zenith. I thought it was uh, over here. It's okay. We're gonna get you worked out. I want you to turn a little oh, bit to the right. Yeah, Thirty degrees to the scary. right. Okay. That was scary. There you go. Good job. We're gonna get your work back to the downwind, and, and it'll be for two right. Eight right. You see the orange and green dots off your left side now. Accidents happen. Zenith, look it up. Does yeah, just like that. That's on the downwind, start your base. That's on the downwind, start your base. Zenith, just keep it going. We're going to work you back into the downwind. Give me another 30 degrees right. Enjoy. All right, 30 right. 
going to monitor this one because that's there's a lot of action on this one. Yeah. Zenith, right? Yeah. Happens. Hey, right, good job, Zenith. Looking good. Just keep it in the air until look, the green Look, that's a Zenith please. right there. You got it, sir. I was too low earlier. I missed the uh, white markings. You know, never okay, be afraid of going around. You hear yeah, me? Yeah. That's a mile north. Better safe than sorry. See, uh, there you go. Hey, good job, Zenith. Looking good. Cessna, just start the, uh, the just turn the downwind. Start your base leg. I want you to turn right direct to the orange dot, and you're cleared to land after the what green. Amazing job. Uh, cleared to land past the green. Clear left. left. Clear yeah. right. Make uh, sure right we check anyway. Directly to the orange dot, and then set it down after the green. Zenith, nice job. You can set it down when you're ready, and then high speed taxi all the way to the end. It'll be the left turn, cross in the big runway, and then follow the flagman on the other side. Welcome to Lakeland. Thank you, now he wants me to relax and stop. Communication is amazing. It, 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 the team here is amazing. Look at this. Look at this. this what is, is that? That's super cool. Uh, looks like a 185. Pretty. Yeah, pretty. Thank My high wing over the uh, over the runway. You're looking really good. Thanks a lot. What he's saying? Okay. Communication is amazing, huh? Yeah, I'm like trying to figure out what they mean. I can wow, so cool. That thing is awesome. My tail dragger Cessna just touched down at you 195. Affirmative. Awesome, looks really good. All the way down to the end for me, please. Left turn and then follow the flagman on the other side. Welcome. Thank you. Left turn and follow the flag. 195. Huh? Where are you from? Cleveland and Cincinnati. Awesome. Thanks for coming down. Hey. It's a long day. It's been a long day. <laughs> it's been a long day. How long of a flight is that? Uh, I'm not sure, but that's a long flight. You want to turn her left down, uh, right down, went for two eight. Just do a right so we're gonna follow him. That's gonna be the right okay. down one for two eight right when you get close to uh, the blue roof terminal building. You see it? Huh. I like the art on that. Tell you what, Cherokee, yeah, it's you're nice. on the base now. How's that for two eight right? Can you do it? Yeah, we can do it. Two four kilo. Awesome. Now, when you're ready, I want you to turn towards the orange dot, and then you're clear to land at the green dot. Roger that, uh, cleared Atlanta to Green Dot on 28. Right. That was a nice flight. That was very fun. That last turn was amazing. Yeah, that was a pretty tight turn and uh, very steep, uh, I have to say. And what do you think if we start shutting down and uh, get to the RV and watch everybody else's land? Sounds good. I want to go look at the plane. Yeah, we're going to look, mile north here, we're gonna uh, look at everybody now. land and the the wait for Eric to and, uh, and your dad. Oh, there. Both Eric's. Both, both Eric's. Huh. We'll see Have you a next good time. rest of your day. That's Great right. job, Cherokee. Hi, Stay speed safe. Back. All the way to the end. Bye. Boom. <laughs> that was amazing.